I haven't decided where I want to go. I kind of wanted to walk into Clinton, but then at the same time, I kind of don't want to. So maybe I'll walk back up into Queerfield again. I'm going to eat that. I'm going to eat that. <clears throat> I forgot today was Friday, so all the little gremlins are out early. So, I hope that doesn't interfere with my live stream in any sort of malefic way. That wouldn't be good. Like, it's okay, we're not watching anyway. It's fine. Like, you people on here, you bitch and whine about wanting to know where I live. <laughs> what the area is and the... The town is like. And all that. And, uh... And then when I film, you don't watch. I don't know if she knew I was filming or not. When people know that you're filming, that one right there, looks like a person. It's not, it's a dummy. <laughs> people know that you're filming, they're on their best behavior. Like, oh, I better not cut that light. It's supposed to be like 70 degrees, so of course I'm wearing black, head to toe. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna sweat all the fat out. Sweat it all out. Sweat spa, baby. People don't ask if I'm gonna play games again because my uh, Let's Plays are garbage. And they are disliked for a reason. Because they're garbage. <clears throat> My GTA on Xbox, though, seem to do pretty well. Fairly well. And I think I streamed... I think I streamed New Vegas on Xbox, and I streamed it on... Well, obviously I streamed it on PC too, but I'm pretty sure I did both. I guess we're going to Queerfield. That's where my feet are taking me. That's where we're going, folks. These people are gonna be so pissed off. I was out here last night. walking and talking and laughing and just goofing off. And they're like, oh, this motherfucker again. That homo freak. pizza at the end of the street supposedly they've reopened again after their their big pizza fire that's like the second pizza joint that's burnt down it's not we're not off to a good start this year unfortunately it was it was limited to just their pizza oven so so uh yeah <clears throat> it's supposed to be like 80 degrees tomorrow and Sunday, I guess. I'm like, it's not even fucking May yet. We're already getting like 80 degree weather. Like... I'm not used to this, 
this this change. I'm used to it gradually getting warmer. Gradually. Oh, that car is on fire. That scooter is on fire, everyone. <laughs> that scooter was blowing smoke, everyone. Like, let's blare the music and blow smoke while there's kids out and about. So I'm just gonna cross the street here. Avoid the little gremlins. Hi, how are you doing? Oh, well, no, looks like they had my idea. Hi, how are you doing? So, I'll just walk up to the pizza joint and see if they're finally open. So it looked like on Facebook they said they were open, but because so I was like, aren't you guys like closed? I'm like, how are, why are you still making pizzas when you're like closed? It's kind of, I'm not gonna lie, it came off as kind of a cunty remark, but. I came out way too soon, or way too late. All the little gremlins and hobgoblins are out and about. I'm not having a good time. But I guess I can still pop in on my friend and queer field. <clears throat> Is that a dog? Oh, no, it's a kid's toy. I thought that was a dog. So that's the ugliest dog I've ever seen. <laughs> Hi, how are you doing? I got my water, I got my 7-Up Zeros, well that's for later. I'm playing Pokemon AR, <laughs> ARG. They really need to come out and fix these sidewalks. They're all cracked up in parts and uneven. If I see cars parked up at alleys, then that'll tell me that they're open. Oh, actually, I forgot my mask. Oh well. <laughs> it smells like they're cooking. I guess they're open again. I guess. I guess they're open again. The pizza place. 
course I can't cross here. We're telling your followers that you started a live video. I'm just gonna walk up on Main Street. I don't want to contend with the little gremlins because they're all boot in a boot right now. I just want to get from point A to point B. But be warned, there's going to be loud, very, very loud decibels of mariachi music very, very soon. Very, very soon. That's that how. Oh, look at that. They're completely digging that out already. Huh. Huh. Interesting. So, is that house new? It makes no sense. Why would they tear. Why would they tear this house down and those houses down but keep that house that makes no sense to me that doesn't that that's that doesn't replicate my french vanilla fantasy accepting new patients <clears throat> but they're not open today. Or they clocked out early. I'm like, oh honey, I am feeling the heat right now. Yeah. I'm just gonna jaywalk right here. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <clears throat> See, I filmed, I think, during the day last time I was here. Because I was pointing out all the little fucking shitty things the city did. <clears throat> The shitty city. there's a house back there weird the way the city ordinances things makes no sense like oh this is a residential area but we're gonna put this big garage thing fucking workshop like right there makes no sense makes no sense it's very obviously commercial. Look at all the fucking business trucks that are parked there. And people get away with it because they know or they're related to the bangers. And they have a big business like that in a residential street. I know because I walk by it every day. Saison de Vero. 
That's the new, that's the name. Don't wear it out. I'm like miserable already. <laughs> 70 degrees, naturally, I wear all black, like a goth or a burglar. Sunset towing on a repair. vintage I've never been in there I've never been inside there I have zero reason to go inside there ever <laughs> I'll never go in there ever oh my god Ugh. that's that dead cat that I saw the other night it was dark then Like, oh, it's an old rag. No, it has paws attached to it. Maybe I won't walk across Green Street. <laughs> no, that's okay. I'll walk down and film down here again. Because they should all be out of school by now. So. <clears throat> and since school's not in session, I can kind of like, I can walk through between the, the seminary area. The seminary driveway and all that. I mean, technically, even after hours, I don't want people walking there, but it's an open street, so it's not like it's closed off. Open street, open secret. Actually, I could technically just go this way and avoid the school altogether. I think that's what I'll do. I forgot the street opens up here. Oh, that's where my evil babysitter used to live. Her name was Melanie and she was a cunt. <laughs> but her sister Tammy was an even bigger cunt. Hi, Melanie. You used to live there? No? Nice to live in these shitty apartments over there. And there was these like white trash redneck guys that lived right around the corner. And they were always trying to kick my ass. I think the rednecks used to live over there. Because they were saying some stuff. And then they got into their truck and were trying to chase after me, but I outran their asses. So. Because I don't think hard, I think smart. Oh, this is much better. This is much easier. Much, much easier. Hi, how you doing?
Actually, that might have been where the rednecks lived. I'm not sure. But I used to live in the apartments back that way. It was like a group of like four buildings with like four flats. And I lived next to this crazy bitch that was always like screaming at her, like at her kids and screaming at her neighbors. And then I got targeted in her crosshairs and she came to my screen door and was like yelling and I'm just looking at her. I'm like, you need to go home immediately because I'm not putting up with your bullshit. I'm aware you're a drug addict and an alcoholic, but that is not my problem. <laughs> and I said, and she said something about not, t not yelling at her kid because her dumb kid was running around on the roof, on our side of the roof. And she said, <clears throat> you get me. Or even call the cops. I said, yeah, I'll call the cops because they're on a first name basis with you. <laughs> and it's not a lie, they were. Every time the cops were there, they go, Joanne, calm down. Well, she's dead now, so it's not really doxing. She's no longer among the living. So it's not really doxing. Yeah, I remember the cops would come by, they'd say, oh, Joanne, calm down, Joanne. What's that 80s song? Come on, Eileen. Calm down. Come on, Joanne. Come off. Come off the pill. Or whatever. But I used to live at the very end of this street in those crappy apartments, and it was awful. Very, very bad. Very, very bad. Very bad man. Very bad man, Jerry Seinfeld. Someone's smokes fell out. There's the school. There's our crossway down here. Looks like they're building something up above the school. It looks like it. Huh. Unless they just haven't painted it. It's like, I have such a dull life now. And if I uploaded the video, you would see I wasn't screaming back at the guy. He was screaming at me. Like, you know those triggered SJW cringe compilation videos on YouTube? He was acting like that, and I was just like, no, you're wrong. That's not a law. I'm not breaking law. Look where I'm standing. I'm nowhere near his vehicle. It's just like, I was calmly reacting to everything he said, and then he wouldn't shut up, so I was like, why are you still talking then? Why are you still talking? <clears throat> That's one thing I've noticed about humans, is when they're losing the debate, or they're losing the fight, they'll start turning to calling you slurs and names, and just being all kinds of vile, because they can't win you know, like a debate. They can't win on good faith. They can't play by the rules. They can't win diplomatically. No, they have to result to name calling. And because it's like when you, when you're a kid, you're raised to, to be polite. But when you become an adult, it's like, oh, I don't have to do that anymore. Like me first is me most is. Like, I can, I can sometimes be that way if I'm in a rush, but, or if I feel like people are just dragging their feet intentionally, they're being slow, but nine times out of ten, like, I do not consider myself to be the main character over all these people. I joke like, oh, look at the NPCs, look at the townies out and about, but it's just that, it's a joke, it's like, it's not serious. <clears throat> but it's like when you're when some of your friends and neighbors and family members like QAnon supporting 
Alex Jones watching conspiratorialists. It's kind of hard to reason with them because like, well, you know, the earth is flat. Well, how can you prove gravity? And it's like, you're asking me to disprove hundreds of years of study of Newton's theory of relativity. And physics. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I mean, and this is another thing is that these people will argue with you because they're bored. They're bored and they're confrontational. So they pick fights with people. And when they lose the fight, they go, well, you have to prove it. So they'll sit here and say, the onus of proof falls to you. Hi. I'm actually going up that way. You know what? You're bored. I'll go that way. I'll go that way. It's fine. Because I have to cross either way. Thank you. Have a good one. And so, so whenever I argue with people, and I don't mean argue like yell or fight, it's just like a debate. But when they start losing, they're like, well, you have to prove it. And I'm like, you're the one who is in disbelief to begin with. And this is common knowledge. Like, it's not my fault that you fell asleep in science class. It's not my fault that you skipped too much school so you don't know your P's and Q's. That's not my fault. <clears throat> Okay. I think most of the little goblins are like, are out of school by now, so I wouldn't have to contend with the horde. Busy, busy. Busy bees. Busy bees today. Does anybody want to dance? <laughs> It's the Chagrin Inn. Oh, it totally, it totally jives with this shit here, doesn't it? An old waltz. <laughs> All these shitty ass new buildings that are ugly and bland and uniform. You know who liked uniform? The Nazis. I, vis-a-vis -vis these buildings are Nazis. Or they're, they're Nazi compliant. Oh, we're still not finished. There's the library. Let's go rent us up some some Skyrim.
I feel bad for my aunt having to drive through all this confusing crap. Got my Joan Jett music blaring. There's where I go to get my STD tests. Cause I'm such a whore. I have to go over there. And the doctor's like, you again? Didn't I see you last week? No, you saw me this last Tuesday. It was pledge week over at, at the Weber, at the Frats. So I've been a busy beaver. Chomp chomp. It was pledge week over at the U, so I've been a busy beaver. Yeah, I'll just take all the vaccines you got to go. It's like the sad thing is I didn't even get paid to do any of that. I did all that for free. Ooh. Dental Apple Creek. Hear the music. My cousin Jeremy works somewhere around here. Hi, cousin. Did you get that thing I sent you? Sandridge Village. Yeah, Sandridge is in fucking Roy. Not Queerfield. All of our sprogs go to Sandridge Jr. in Roy. That's how special we are. This is like the nicest, nicest part of the whole complex. This little like brick, yellow brick road. Oh. oh. I was talking shit on it and I got punished. That yellow brick road's like the nicest part. What am I saying? Uneven sidewalks, Jesus. Road close, local traffic only. Oh yeah? Challenge accepted. 
You don't know that I'm not local. You don't know that I'm not local. Challenge accepted. Hi, my name's Chills. If you enjoyed my video, thank you. You should go to my Instagram page where you can see what I look like. Angry Karens at Burger King might have been getting more than they bargained for. <laughs> That's how he talks. That's how Chill sounds. Oh my hell, it's only like a hundred degrees out here. They're like, what on earth is he? Why is he all dressed in black? Like, what the hell? Because I'm a sadist. They're like tearing up the asphalt or something. I assume. <clears throat> Shut up, you. He just pissed on the fence. <laughs> he just pissed on the chain link fence. <laughs> We're telling your one subscriber you have a video. Right on. I'm just recording live in case something happens to me. In case some young thug brutalizes me. Hey y'all, Pizza Hut's hiring. They're hiring over at the hut. Job of the hut. I remember I had like a, an interview with this twink at Pizza Hut years ago. And like a few years later, I ended up like on a one night stand. Oh, I remember. You, you're the manager at Pizza Hut. Call me. a sadist. I send myself on all these ridiculous schemes for no apparent reason.
There's Baskin Robbins, everyone. That's for all the. The fuck is this bitch doing? That's where all the rapes happen. There's some unwitting rape victim right now pulling up and ready to get sodomized. I've never seen that in the daytime before. That used to be an Italian restaurant. The mafia ran it because there's a lake behind it, and you know, they got rid of all their, their enemies. <sighs> Iglesia Cristiana. So that means. Enrique Iglesias means Enrique Churches. <laughs> if you wanted to anglicize it, that's what it would be. Oh, wow. There's the ducks. There's the geese. Somewhere around here has got to be the Rio Grande Trail entrance, but I don't know where. Look at all these dirty Canucks in our American lake. Disgusting. You go back to Canada. Yeah, you heard me. Look at that little duck. She's washing her face. There's people over there. They talk. They're they're being all conspiratorial and all that. They're being all kinds of conspiratorial. They're talking about where they're gonna put the dead bodies. It doesn't look very good for little Jimmy. I wonder if I should just end this video here because there's honestly nothing to see on the way back. Unless I just like fall into the lake and drown like Jason Voorhees. Wouldn't that be funny? Wouldn't that be amusing? I guess we're going live again. We're going live again. And we are going to document my travel from this place, El Lago de Clearfield, to where I have to go in Roy. Yeah, all the drug dealers are upset because I'm here and I'm throwing off, throwing off their, uh, their drug game. I 
can't I can't make any money with this with this fool hanging around oh there's a noose hanging up there there's a noose I'm gonna I'm gonna hashtag this Cal City because it looks just like Cal City Hashtag yo mama. I think this is the publicly accessible sidewalk. They can't have me get hit by a car. spare time again. Like, wow, he sure goes to Queerfield a lot. In films. There's, like, a lot of religious... Like, I'm not saying they're scam churches, but there's, like, a lot of, like, fly-by-night. Like, just, you know, generic, non-sequitur Christian churches. Because I guess they all have, like, something they uh, reject against or something. This used to be the little, like, mini-mart. You could go there and get milk and cigarettes, and that's the drive through obviously. Or it used to be. And they used to have a Hardee's down there, too. That was, like, almost... 30 years ago. Thirty years ago. Like some guy sends me these nasty pictures last night. And I just respond with nasty. So he sends me even more. And I'm like, okay, I get that I'm not a teen. I'm like almost 40, but like. Since when has nasty ever meant good? If you send someone a picture of your butthole and, and the person responds with, that's nasty, isn't that akin to saying, that's gross, fuck off, or whatever? It's, it's, it's not code for, yes, please send me more. Especially when you, you send it to me <laughs> unbidden, unprovoked. <laughs> If I, if I were so inclined, I could have, like, reported him. Not that it would have done anything, because that app is just garbage, and y'all know what app I'm talking about. It's the all-straight inclusive app. This is clearly not a gay-centered app anymore. There's the haunted building. One, two, three, four. There's, like, four... Four floors, fun. That's gonna be apartments, it's gotta be, or condos. Cause they got a drive-in parking in the bottom. And look how wide the bottom is right there in the back. Unless they're gonna put fucking stores in the bottom. And then have the actual living arrangements up top. They finished one of these buildings not far from here. In fact, I think it was like uh, up close to where Kent's was. I'm surprisingly, I feel pretty good. I don't feel like exhausted or wiped out or, 
any kind of like manic type of way. I feel like today's excursion was actually, it was kind of unprompted, but uh, I feel like it worked out for the most part. My name's Justin. <laughs> no, that's not the right. <laughs> Exit stage left. <laughs> My name's Judy. Judge Judy. My, my name's Herbert. <laughs> This bitch ain't local traffic. We belong to the light, we belong together. Piggy, 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 piggy. Oh, there's a drug deal going down over there. Drug deal. It's definitely a drug deal. I know one when I see one. Absolutely. Shiba Taekwondo. Amazing. Feels like a good day to be a Karen. I'll be a Karen to random unsuspecting twinks that I find. I know a drug deal when I see one. I know a twink porn star when I see one. Children's Service Society of Utah. What? What? Is that an actual affiliation? Because it ain't CPS, which is just Child Protective Services. Oh, wow. Awesome. Awesome job, buddy. <laughs> oh, Lord. I ain't your buddy, guy. I ain't your friend, pal. I don't really care for them trying to turn Clearfield into Salt Lake. Like, I just don't think it needs to happen. You got all these fucking neckbeards coming from California and New York and everywhere else. God damn it. Uh, we can't forget about the Canadians. You think they're sharing any of their maple syrup with me? No. Mr. Morris, the fourth graders are on fire again. I don't think they're going to make it this time. Mr. Morris, I have terrible news. 
Johnny, the third grader, is gay. What do you mean you're not going to do anything? That little fag says he likes to taste a cock in his mouth but doesn't enjoy my cookies. I'm finding all this like Pokemon related shit on my um, Instagram. I don't know what you call it. It's like the home, like I guess the feed page or whatever, where it says like just random shit. I think my phone has been listening to me, like absolutely. Because it knows I have Pokemon Go on here, I guess. But I've been playing Pokemon Red like on my Super Game Boy, so if it knows I've been doing that, then I'm in a hell of a lot of a trouble. Because it's been spying on me big time in that case. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. The impatient cucks. The impatient cucks of Utah society. There we go. Are they not open today? Oh no, it's Friday. Of course they're not open. People don't have to do learning on Fridays. That's ridiculous. It's that asshole who always angry streams all the time. <clears throat> These apartments are so fucking ugly. Like, I can't imagine anybody would willingly want to live there. They're hideous. They're literally fucking hideous gross. They have no character to them. None at all whatsoever. And more little hipster shops to come. Hipster hangouts. The Wi-Fi password will be vegan. I imagine this alley right here is a perfect opportunity for crime. Perfect opportunity. What are they doing? They're, di they're digging the fucking holes by hand. <laughs> Did they fuck up with the little tree planters that I had to dig it by hand? They don't have the requisite tools to do it. They have to do it by hand, manually. How droll. Oh. How droll. Oh lord. Oh my. How droll. I've never seen construction people just like in halfway in the ground digging with their bare fucking hands. I've never seen that. Have they run out of budget <clears throat> for tools? So why isn't there a little crescent moon gold? Why is it only silver? I thought it would be gold. And then the dome the dome part would be silver. I guess, I don't know. 
I'm not Muslim, so I don't fucking know. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, you're not gonna make me quit using Windows 7. I still use it. Win 7. I still use it. Mr. Morris! The fourth grader's on fire again. I don't think they're going to make it this time. There used to be a furniture store. I do recall. There's that sleazy park. Ugh. Never again. <laughs> oh yeah, get out of here. Drive through only, honey. So you have to go through the drive through on a skateboard. You know, for a fat guy, I'd feel pretty good today. That's not fair, she got a head start. Cunt. Oh, is it my turn? Oh no, keep going Marjorie, it's fine. There's the mystery machine. There's the mystery machine up ahead. Oh my god. The mystery machine. Have you ever seen Islamists get into arguments and they call each other my friend? And it's like almost like a bitchy, it's like a way a gay person or a Canadian or a woman would say it like they don't really mean you're my friend. They're being condescending. Like, no, 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 you are haram, my friend. You are very haram. You are very haram, my friend. <laughs> Get out of the car and argue. <laughs> That's why I don't drive. I don't ride Uber anymore. I walk everywhere. I don't care what religion you are. When it says the ride is going to be here in five fucking minutes, I expect it to be five minutes. Not 51 minutes. It's ridiculous. It's crazy. Oh, there's a mystery machine. It's a mystery machine. Mystery machine. Sponsored by 7up0. Not really, it's not, it's not. There's useless cop number three. Officer Flickbeam. <laughs> Well, hi, princess. How you doing, honey? How are you doing, princess? Oh, I love you too, honey. You're such a sweet girl. I know, it's been rough since the sex change. It's been rough. It's been, it's been rough on all of us. There's Officer 
Officer Dick Little. Officer Dick Little. Oh my lord, someone vomited their their diarrhea all over the sidewalk. That is so uncouth. Wow, my shadow has lost five pounds. Amazing. Wow. Heat stroke does a lot for the body. <sighs> oh, wow. <coughs> I guess that house is new. So what the hell are they going to put over here? Because, yeah, that makes tons of sense. That house is gone. That house is gone. Then that other house that's ugly as all hell. Because that makes tons of sense. Well, I guess we're walking into Clinton.